the theme of this entire film is to really embrace your authentic self. Um, however, the stakes are very high because, like I said before, the country they're living in is not a safe place for the gay community. And so individuals who um, go outside of conventional norms might be targeted or might be getting in legal trouble um, because of how they present in public, who they interact with, and who they love. Um, I thought that the cinematography was really wonderful. There were lots of really gorgeous shots that were kind of playful um, but matched the mood. The lighting in the party scenes was kind of pink and purple, kind of dark and seductive. Um, but in the daytime and the outside, it was very bright and harsh, reminded us of reality. Um, and I also wanted to note the costumes and the hair and makeup in this short film were very expressive. Of course, this was intentional with the um, main character uh, really expressing it themselves through fashion. Um, but I noticed that characters who seem to be more confident in their, um, in their experience or in their sexuality were more playful, um, wore more colorful clothes, wore more dramatic makeup and dramatic hairstyles, um, while the individuals who were maybe um, more afraid to uh, fear from the norms were in uh, more traditional conservative colors and clothing styles were wearing less makeup. Um, and I really just enjoyed how the costumes and the hair and makeup in this film uh, helped further the audience's experience of the characters. Right at the top where it starts, that piano was so gorgeous and so beautiful. I kind of wanted that to trail into that first scene a little bit before it faded off into the distance because it was just such a beautiful composition. Um, I really liked this film. I thought that the story was great. The acting was really, really good. Um, filmmakers did a great job with their cinematography. Yeah, it was really cool. Um, the story was well told. The actors really were very believable, very organic. Being yourself, being open, being out as a queer person. And I feel like there are so many misunderstandings about showing your personality as a gay or a queer person in the community. And this one tried to amplify that message, like how important that we need to be ourselves right now, even though it could cause like any uh, disturbances or any um, hard feelings to any other people, but it's just got to be you. So the theme, the concept of the short uh, in cliche is, really strong and really obvious and it's well produced it sounds like it looks like it could be like a feature version with like the setting the performances the cinematography and this music background it's well blended in a good balance i think that this really really highlighted and goes to show the importance of having a place where you feel accepted and you can be yourself and that you don't feel trapped or stifled in any way um, and not just a place to be able to have that freedom of expression, to be able to have that, but also having friends and having people around you and to surround yourself that also accept you and that you feel like you can be yourself around, that you don't have to stifle parts of your personality or you don't have to be less or you don't have to, you know, do any of those things that you can just be yourself. And so I think that this highlights the the importance of not just having a physical location where you feel the freedom, you feel the acceptance that where it's safe to do so but also having the the community, the people, the friends um, that you can surround yourself with, where you can have that same thing, where you can be yourself and you don't have to stifle or make less of or, you know, hide or pretend um, to be anything but yourself. Enjoy the adventure, the fight of the film. It revolves around these bar, these uh, cliché, which is 
it's not just a bar, it's not just a place. It, it's more like somewhere where all the people, any kind of person, any human out there is welcome and well accepted. And there is this beautiful community where everyone just loves each other. Um, there's also good conflict between the main characters and a good question though until the final at the ending, everyone inside that cliche, uh, dancing and having a great night. It's a treat for the visual senses. It's a lot of beautiful bright colors, really great designs. Um, and I think visually it really helps move the plot and the story along and show that character growth and development in when faced with society's oppression. And I think it does it really beautiful within the movie.